What's up guys, I'm Levi from Shred Shop and today we're going to be reviewing the 101 skateboards thanks to Nautis Copus, these reissues. A bit of history about 101 skateboards, it was started by Nautis Copus and Steve Rocco back in the 90s. They're known for having some of the most controversial graphics that ever were to skateboarding. And they're going to start bringing back a bunch of reissue, really iconic graphics in the seasons to come. This is the Good and Evil series. This is Gabriel Rodriguez Pro Model. This is Nautis Copus Pro Model. We're going to check them out. On Gabriel Rodriguez board, he's a picture of Jesus. He grew up Catholic, and this board's based off of a picture that was above his mantle at his parents' house growing up. This board is the evil one of the Good and Evil series. It was actually originally drawn and designed for Jason Lee from My Name is Earl, if you know him. He said, no way, you're not putting my name on this. This is way too gnarly, way too evil, but not as was down. So the art for this board was actually done by a guy named Mark McKee. He's one of the most famous skateboard artists of all time. There's actually a ton of controversy around this board. Nottis, his name spelled backward, is Satan. It's actually screened upside down. He's actually not a Satanist. He's not into that, I guess. It's pretty crazy. This board all around is probably the most evil board of all time, which is pretty gnarly when you think of all the graphics that are out there. People actually believe that it was cursed because of how offensive it is, because right after it came out, Nottis actually shattered his ankle, ending his entire skateboard career. He said he wasn't riding this board at the time, but... Thanks for watching. Check out our other vids. You know. Peace. Check out my deck.